Hey everyone, today, we're diving into a groundbreaking development in the world of refrigeration. Researchers at the Hong Kong University of Science and Technology, HKUST, have set a new world record in cooling performance with a device that promises to revolutionize the way we cool our homes, buildings, and even entire cities, all while being eco-friendly. Let's take a closer look at this record-breaking technology and how it could shape a greener, more efficient future. Welcome to Trendstorm. Chapter 1. The Big Problem, Traditional Cooling Tech. Cooling technology isn't just about keeping things cold, it's also a huge contributor to global warming. Traditional refrigeration relies on vapor compression systems, which use refrigerants that have a high global warming potential. As a result, cooling systems, like air conditioners, are responsible for a significant portion of greenhouse gas emissions. But what if we could cool things down without warming up the planet? That's exactly where elastocaloric cooling comes in a technology that uses shape memory alloys to absorb and release heat during phase transitions, with zero greenhouse gas emissions and 100% recyclability. Chapter 2. HKUST's Breakthrough, Record-Breaking Cooling Performance Now, here's where HKUST's team comes into play. Led by Professor Sun Qingping and Professor Yao Shuhuai, the researchers have developed a multi-material cascading elastocaloric cooling device made from nickel-titanium, NITI, shape memory alloys. This system has smashed the world record, achieving a temperature lift of 75K, surpassing the previous record of 50.6K. To put it simply, this means their device can transfer heat from a cold source to a hot sink more effectively than ever before. Plus, they achieved a 48% efficiency boost, which is a massive leap forward in terms of performance. So, why is this so important? Well, higher temperature lifts mean more effective cooling and heating, making it easier to scale this technology for real-world applications. Chapter 3. How they did it. The science behind the breakthrough. So, how did they achieve this world record cooling performance? The HKUST team used three NITI alloys, each with different phase transition temperatures, to optimize cooling across multiple stages. By carefully matching the working temperatures of each unit to its optimal phase transition temperature, they expanded the system's overall cooling range to over 100K. This allowed them to maximize both efficiency and performance giving their device an edge over traditional methods. This research, recently published in Nature Energy, opens the door for more durable and scalable cooling systems that are free from harmful gases and highly energy efficient. Chapter 4. The Future of Cooling. What's next? Now, let's talk about what this means for the future. Space cooling and heating account for a whopping 20% of global electricity consumption, and by 2050, it's projected to become the second largest source of electricity demand worldwide. With this new elastocaloric technology, we could see a massive reduction in energy usage, making it a key tool in decarbonizing our world. The HKUST team isn't stopping here. They plan to push this technology even further by developing high-performance shape memory alloys for sub-zero cooling and high-temperature heat pumping applications. Their goal? To bring next-generation green cooling systems to market, helping tackle both global warming and the worldwide energy crisis head-on. With this record-breaking cooling device, HKUST has taken a bold step toward a more sustainable future. As we face the challenges of global warming and the growing demand for energy, innovations like this are crucial for transforming our world. Source
Hong Kong University of Science and Technology. If you're excited about the potential of eco-friendly technologies like elastocaloric cooling, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to Trend Storm and let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.